cheese it. White cheddar addiction. These cheese it, they are so damn addictive to me. I don't know why. And I, I like the white cheese, the Parmesan cheese. I have a habit getting these chips. I'm trying to refrain from not buying them. But, but I just can eat them all day. Mm -mm -mm. Those are the only kind I like. This is the one I like, the white cheddar. Oh. But two nineteen, pretty pricey. And they used to cost a dollar. Two nineteen versus me getting big bags and just eat cheddar and from the farm. I really like the white cheddar. Y'all, I did good. I didn't get the cheeses, but I'm telling you, I have an addiction problem. So that drug in there, even if I'm at home and somebody say something about snacks, I tend to go uh, to the apps, uh, regardless if it's Target or 7-Eleven, because they always carry them and I would order them. So today I decided to dig in deep. Why is it I'm always craving it even when I don't want, no, I don't need it. I already know that it doesn't have anything healthy in it, but it's something in those products that keeps triggering in my brain. And you know, I, I do have a cheese addiction. I love cheese. That, that's one of my biggest downfalls. I'm not gonna lie about that. It takes a lot for me to refrain from it. But it's just amazing how they put chemicals there to do, to control your mind so you can eat bad and then they'll say, oh, what you're eating is, uh, you got diabetes, you have heart disease and stuff like that. But it's not what it's not the food. It's what they putting in the food that cause more harm. But then, even though cheese is not healthy for you, it's like a it doesn't have any grain in it. And that's just like white rice. It doesn't have any grains. There's nothing really healthy about white rice. But everybody love it and eat it. They prefer that over the brown rice or black rice or any other kind of rice that is healthy for you. It's just a thought. With the nine dollar uh, plus bucks, tax, plus tax. Look, yeah. the next one, man. I'm sure. Huh. Huh? How much was that? Oh, so you went $2 over. You mm -hmm. didn't know how to stay under $9. So what all you bought in there? <laughs> you, since you got your big books from 7-Eleven. 7, 7, I mean, CVS. You know sometimes we don't never get back around and going because we get those because um, we yeah, so, shop here so with our medicine. No problem. So what do you get? Yeah. I can't see it. Yeah. Oh, some uh, lemon breast. Is that all? This for you. What does it mean? A damn ink pen. I thought I was gonna get a snack. You get a snack. I thought you was gonna come out with the cheese and you gonna bring me some damn ink pens. You just bought me ink pens, so you tired of me asking for your ink pens? You got it. Oh. So uh, I got a sure mine with fridges too, huh? No, you give me the old one. You give me what I gave you. <sighs>